Can you talk about coming back to Philadelphia? It's always great to come back to Philadelphia, especially to play hockey. You know, the the great hockey city, it's a great uh, atmosphere, great environment all the time. When you come into this building in particular, there's no better place in the in the hockey world than playing Philadelphia. Did you talk about the crowd reaction and the large crowd event? Yeah, I was real happy for the young guys, you know, to be able to play in that kind of uh, that kind of environment, I, you know, it's tremendous for them, the experience that they're going to now take out of this game as far as handling the, handling the, 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 the focus, handling the pressure, handling the, the responsibility of coming out and play well. And I thought we came out and played very good in the first period. You know, we had our feet moving, and as we got into the second period, we, we got a little bit uh, too far away from each other to give the support, and they started coming through us and got, uh, got a lot of scoring opportunities. But at the end of the day, here played well and uh, kept us there, and we had a chance in the third period. Coach, how do you rebound from a match like this where you control a lot of it and you move into third? I think you just got to talk about it and deal with it. You know, the difference in the game is is one puck out, one puck one puck in. You know, as far as going through the middle of the ice sometimes, or hitting a post, or you know, taking advantage of a couple of the breakaways that we had. So we played well, and we have to uh, we have to understand that. And you know, you deal with the uh, with the end result and bounce back and play again tomorrow night. Chunk of the season, you know, there's not a lot of time for moral victories though. Oh yeah, there's lots of time for moral victories. Absolutely, there is. You know, that's that's part of the process of growing up, and becoming a good pro player. You got to celebrate the little things. There's a lot of good things that happen in this game. We're becoming more of a consistent uh, young group of players here. You know, we're battling right through to the last minute of the game, and uh, so there's lots of well, there's a lot of positives we'll take out of this. But at the end of the day, what we need to understand is that there's a it's a very fine line in this game. You know, it's one goal. It's again, as I've said, it's getting the puck out of our zone off that face-off. If that's out, we might come away with a win. Can you talk just a little bit about Peter overall tonight? You know, he gets the start and he plays a pretty good game. Who's that? Peter. Peter played well. He competed and battled hard, absolutely. I and mean, he, uh, especially in the second period, they were coming at us. They put a lot of pucks on the net. And he kept us there and gave us an opportunity and uh, going into the third period. That's all you want. Between the first and the second period, you know, I... Is there anything in particular that you guys changed? You tried to seem like you were stretching out a little bit there, trying to make some of the long passes that we talked about. Well, I thought our gaps, our spacing got a little bit too big in the second period, and we talked about that between periods. You know, whether it's in the offensive zone trying to recover pucks, we, the three forwards, they got a little too far apart, and the uh, the support's not there fast enough. Or same in our own end on our breakouts, the we we make a first pass, but the second uh, pass was not made or not completed because we're too far away from from the man who's receiving, and, and that's the difference in in a clean breakout or or spending another 20 seconds in your own end. And I thought we regrouped in the in the third. We came out with a good push right away and got some pucks to the net. And we had a uh, we had a couple of real good looks actually. So um, we need to be a better scoring team. But at the end of the day, I, I thought our effort was pretty good. A lot of the rookies, you know, came through with really strong efforts. Later with a good fight there. Uh, Noble had a goal. You know, we talked about Heater before, but some of the biggest performers were the, were the young guys tonight. Well, it's a great opportunity for them to uh, play in front of the Flyer management and. You know, in front of the Flyer fans and, and to show what they can do and who they are. They're, they're hoping someday that their dream comes true, and that's the play for the Flyers. And uh, what a better place to try to establish your name as a uh, as a young player and let the fans remember you, so that the, when you do get your call, you're they're going to be cheering for you right away. What happened to Peter there? Uh, you got a lower body injury. Thanks, coach.